Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So I know it's been a while since I posted my last video. Uh, I'm filming this in October, 2022. Uh, the days are getting shorter. The, uh, the temperature is getting lower and it's York week, which in my mind that officially kicks off train season. So hopefully I should have a few more videos out to you guys here uh, over the next few months and really kind of the, the core of train season to, uh, to share some stuff with you guys. Um, so today, the first thing I want to show is I got in some new uh, Lionel horse cars. These are the Vision Line cars that were in the catalog here earlier this year. And I want to uh, want to run them around the layout and share them with you guys. <laughs> All right, so taking a closer look at these cars. Uh, these were, as I said, the Vision Line cars from the... Lionel 2022 Volume 1 catalog. And uh, I got the Pennsylvania Railroad horse car and then the Polar Express reindeer car. So uh, these are sound cars. They have quillable horses in them um, or reindeer. And, uh, and they're a ton of fun to run around. They're a great a attraction for guests and kids and, um, and really just add a lot of sound and, and things to lay out. So Let's look at the Pennsylvania first, and then we'll look at the Polar Express reindeer car. All right, so let's fire this car up. There we go, the horses in there are going nuts. Uh, so my wife rides horses and I grew up on a farm. So for me, this one was a no brainer. And I also you know, run a lot of Pennsylvania Railroad stuff, and this has the brown roof and green trucks, and I have an MTH Madison set that has that as well. I love that scheme, so this one was, uh, you know, was an easy decision. But let's go through some of the sounds on the car. So this is the uh, loading sequence here. I think there's a couple different sequences for each, but we'll go through a couple of them. Get them ready, line them up. All right, these are in. Next stop is for feeding and watering. You gotta walk up a bit too. Okay. Okay, we're ready. Give them the go. You gotta be gentle but firm with her. Grab some of that grain for them. We're hauling oats. Get them ready. Line them up. Okay. All right, ease her in. Grab some of that grain for them. We're hauling oats. So those are the the loading sequences. Now let's do the unloading sequences. The drover gave us the all clear. We're good. Make sure you spray off those ramps too. Nice work. At the track, on time. The drover gave us the all clear. We're good. That's it. These are out of the stall. Nice work. At the track, on time. All right, open up the gate and let's get those fillies unloaded. All right. I'll take her from here. Thanks. That's how we do it. And that is most of the most of the sounds here. You can see the the horse sound is quillable. So you can quill that with the whistle, which is so much fun. And when this thing runs around here, it uh it has some nice brake wheels and, and grinding and things that it does. But then it'll also let out an occasional horse sound as well. So that's the Pennsylvania car. Let's look at the the Polar Express reindeer car next. So you can see the sounds are a little different. It does sound more like a reindeer instead of a horse. Um, I bought this because I am trying to, I don't want to say collect, but get a decent consist of Polar Express passenger cars and ultimately hope to one day find the, the scale Berkshire um, to run around uh, at Christmas time. But this one, the first thing I noticed, and maybe you guys noticed this too, is the paint job is a little light. Uh, so let me get out here another Polar Express car, and I'll show you the difference. So side by side, you know, the first thing I noticed when I took the car out of the box was the color difference here. And 
it's pretty disappointing. You know, I, I shouldn't be surprised at this point um, with some of the color challenges that Lionel's had, but you know, it's still an awesome car. I don't, I wouldn't return it or anything. Uh, it, it's just kind of disappointing that the color doesn't match. So I have reached out to Lionel just to let him know the issue. You know, maybe they'll fix it. I know that they did fix the RPO cars a couple years ago that didn't match, that didn't match the rest of the passenger cars. So we'll see what happens there. But as I said, otherwise this car is awesome. So let's, uh, let's check out the sounds. <laughs> So it still has coolable sounds here, just the, the reindeer. Let's do the loading and then unloading sounds. Make sure those water tanks are full. Come on, boy, watch that step. Good boy. Next stop is for feeding and watering. You gotta walk them a bit too. Get them ready, line them up. Throw a couple extra hay bales in there. Those carrots were supposed to be for the deer. Okay, we're ready. Give them a go. Come on, boy. Watch that step. Good boy. Nicely done. All right, and then unloading. All right, open up the gate. Let's get these deer unloaded. Wait, where's Blitzen? That's how it's done. Let's get these deer unloaded. Make sure you spray off those ramps, too. Nice work. At the North Pole before sunup. Arrived at the North Pole. Let's get them unloaded. Alrighty. That's it. These are out of the stall. Great job unloading. Now let's get this car cleaned out. So there you have it. Uh, I really like that they you know, actually made some unique sounds for the reindeer car itself and the reference to Blitzen and the North Pole and the carrots for the deer. That's so cool. Um, you know, I, I think these cars are a lot of fun and they will definitely be a hit with uh, with guests and things, especially this one around the holidays. So I have my Polar Express train uh, really in storage, so we're not going to run this one at the moment. We'll save this one for, for Christmas time here, at least till we get past Thanksgiving. Uh, but we are going to run the Pennsylvania Railroad one around here with uh, an MTH consist of a similar paint job. And uh, and I'll show you guys, you know, what it looks like right on the layout. So enjoy. Dispatcher, we're ready. Is it okay to pull? Over. Roger, your track is clear. Dispatcher, over. <laughs> Thank you much. Cleared outbound. Out.
those colts to their trainers. Make sure you spray off those ramps too. Great job unloading. Now let's get this car cleaned out. Going to sign the register book, dispatcher. Out.